Good morning. Look what we have here. What is this? A basket of vegetables. Food that are healthy. That's right. This is food that's healthy. And you know, we've been talking about this wonderful, wonderful earth that God gave us. Where did these vegetables and apples grow? From the ground. That is so right. And the ground is made out of wonderful what? Soil. Soil. We are going to talk about dirt and soil today and have so much fun with it. Now, you know what's amazing to me? God designed this food for our bodies. And I'm going to ask, Wally, you're an experienced reader. Would you read that, please? Then God said, I give you every seed bearing plant on the face of the whole earth and every tree that has fruit with seed in it. They will be yours for food. Genesis 1:29. Thank you so much. You read so well, Wally. So God designed this food for us. Let's see how much we know about it. Why did God give us, what's this, and why did God give it to us? A carrot. God gave it to us because the animals needed something to eat. The animals eat carrots, too. This is good for the same part of the animal that it's good for us. Does anybody know what that is? It's to help humans and animals see better. That is so right, Aiden. We can write our own health book right here. Maybe we'll do that when we go downstairs. Now, this is what? An apple. Okay. And what is the apple good for? It's good for our health. Um, and it's also nutritious to help us get, get more stronger and live more gooder lives. That's right. You are so straight about all of this. Now we have, what is this guy right here? Um, a white onion. It, it, it is in the, in the onion family, that's correct. Do you know what this is? Do you know what this is? Garlic. Wow, what do we do with garlic? We make food with garlic, and it's also helping us so we understand more about onions and other things that are in the same family as onions. This is so true. Thank you so much. And garlic is like a natural penicillin for our body. So when we're sick or if we feel like we've got a cold coming on, we drink some garlic tea. And presto, God has given us this wonderful, wonderful medicine. Okay, last thing. Oh, this guy. What's this? Just a moment. You can describe it. What do you, what do you think? A turnip. It's in the turnip family. Do you know what this is? A radish. It's in the radish family, too. Does anybody know what this is? I, now, the calluses certainly can help us with this. <laughs> it looks like a beet. Say it again. A beet. It is a beet. We have adult consensus on the beet. Okay. Here's what the beet does for us that God designed in such brilliance. This beet cleanses our blood. That's why we should always have beets in our salad and make beet juice. It is so good. Now, here's the other thing that God has done for us when God gave us all these vegetables. The only way we can have these vegetables is if we live in community. We cannot farm by ourselves. When we farm, we farm with other people. People have to come and help us with the harvest. So God gave us this food for our bodies, and then God gave us community. He wants us to be together. God wants us to work together. God wants us to be together in profound, deep, wonderful community and have lots of fun. And we're going to go downstairs and cut an apple up and look at these seeds, and then we are going to play in so much dirt. Wow! I'm going to ask, would you read this, and then we'll go downstairs. The earth is Lord's and fullest thereof. 
I can't just read. Uh, you're, you're doing very well. Um, there of Paul 21, verse 1. Thank you so much. Will you stand up and, Wally, would you carry this for us downstairs, please? Thank you so much.